What's up, guys? Pitman here, Carolina Varsity. We're going to take a look at the Week 2 matchup between South Rowan going over to play A.L. Brown in their home opener. Uh, this is a traditional rival game that um, A.L. Brown usually uh, dominates, having the tradition that they've had. They've been good for a very long time. Uh, South Rowan last week lost 33-9 to Salisbury, who's in the uh, 2A ranks. So, um, you know, South Rowan typically has struggled throughout the years, and um, it looks like they're still trying to um, get things going here. And I know they've made a co coaching change recently, and um, sometimes it takes a little more time to get things turned around. Uh, for A.L. Brown, they're coming off the big win in the Bell game over Concord, 31-19. Their defense played extremely well, and the offense made the most of the opportunities they were given. Uh, Coach Newsom in the home opener, I'm sure, is looking to jump early up on South Rowan and not give them hope and hang around and make it a game that, you know, shouldn't be that close, uh, to be honest with you. Um, however... You know, we've seen several times here in Charlotte area, especially rival games, throw out the records, and, uh, you know, just let things happen. Uh, the quarterback for A.L. Brown, hopefully he's doing better. I know he had the uh, nasty injury. We heard it was a dislocated knee. Um, looked like it could have been worse, but thank God it wasn't. Uh, so A.L. Brown will have to work um, another quarterback in for the whole game this time. Um, maybe South Rowan can take advantage of that possibly and put some pressure on them. Uh, but you know, with coach Newsom, you know, he's an offensive genius. So, you know, it's, it's a tough uphill challenge here for South Rowan to, uh, get better, um, going from Salisbury to AL Brown. Uh, I'm sure it'll be a big crowd out there after the big AL Brown win. Uh, hope you guys have a good game and, uh, play safe. Thanks for watching.